YouTube. Been doing some good work in the in the mid stakes these days. We're continually firing at some higher stakes, and you know, to be honest, a lot of these high stake tournaments haven't gone well for me. Today, though, we get one going a little bit. It's a 1K multi day tournament. It's a really good video. Hope you enjoy it. Cutoff raises. Defending, hitting. This is a middling connected board. I think I'm just gonna play the call here. I mean, it could just raise and stack off. But on a connected board like this. And once we just check call, this is one of the strongest hands we can have. You could be bluffing with king, queen, ace, queen, ace, nine. We are committed to this hand. Turn is an absolute brick. <laughs> and I will check call the river. Give him a chance to bluff. I mean, if he goes small, small, small. I think we'll have to call this one. Having the king is not great, especially the king of clubs is not great. Um, but I think when I call flop, called turn, he's going to put me on a lot of hands like a weak jack, weak 10. It runs out pretty clean. Um, It's not my favorite, no doubt. It's not my favorite spot. Ah, uh, we are going to call. Be good. Just flops a set of 10s. Nice hand. I mean, we, we all, the other option was like raise flop, get it in. Like it's actually a pretty sick cooler, especially when he's on the short stack. Okay, peel here in the uh, the 1K. He raises button. Ah, we meet again, Mr. Omaha for LOLs. This time a good flop for my hand in range. He raises the button. I defend top pair and a gut shot. He goes with a large size. Calling. And we turn a straight. Should be leading sometimes, but he actually has a lot of 9x. I don't think we're going to lead. Amazing turn here, obviously. He has enough 9x in his range where I don't think we play the lead with the straight. We got a straight this time, Mr. Omaha. We're just going to be calling, and, and uh, I mean, there's a chance he definitely has a 9, but there's a chance he tries to rep it. Board pairs. We're just still check calling river. Man, if this guy gets me here again when I make another big hand in the big blind. The thing is, he's not betting two pair. He doesn't have many boats. We just lose to 9-10. I mean, maybe he's kamikaze bluffing. Definitely think 9-10 is out there. Don't think there's boats. I'm very worried about 9-10. <laughs> Calling. 10 jack, he was bluffing. I like that hand choice as bluff. Boom! We got him back! Okay, raising King Jack here. Happy Jacks. Flats. Quickly. Sets up a good squeeze spot for the big blind. Okay, um... Versus small blind. I know if we're playing versus big blind, we auto bet this board. Happy Jacks, happy Jacks. I don't think we're gonna get check raised much, so I'm still gonna just bet. Like he doesn't have the best aces, so I don't think we're gonna. S wow, we're not getting check raised much. He just check raises me. So pretty large size as well. Tough spot. Gonna find the call. He checks. Okay. Um. We're still gonna see a lot of ace check, ace 10, I guess. That check raise flop, check turn, but we're happy to check back. Interesting. So weird he check raised this flop. Nah, it goes large. That's really bizarre. That doesn't make any sense. Because ace nine barrels turn, he would check raise a hand with a nine. That would make sense. Oh, fuck, why do I want to call again, man? A nine with a club? I just, I, <laughs> Why am I getting owned in that spot again, man? Um, fuck me, I can't believe he chose that size on the river. Okay, a couple short stacks doubled. <laughs> it's not good. Not good for me. We gotta peel some. Oh, baby. So we don't have aces, please. Oh! We peel the Church of Ace King in the big blind. In my weakest of moments. 
I have peeled the nuts to come and save me on the 1K bubble. This is big. They have queen 10. I have ace king. And we flop a king. Boom! I love you, ace king. Wow, you single-handedly came and lifted my spirit on a 1k bubble that was looking not very hopeful. But look at this. By no means is it over, but we do shoot up to 19th position. <gasps> All right. All right. Hey. Okay. Final 27. Guys, we cashed the 1K off of one bullet. Man, I've been smoked in the 1Ks lately. Not here, not now. Here we go. Come on, guys. Two more levels away from a day two. Let's not go home. I'm all in with the nines. Should be very feeling very good against this uh, all in. Good luck. Pocket nines, super killer. Pocket sixes, that's perfect. Hold. Come on, man, no six. Vamos! Let's go. A little ace queen, hmm. I sense another big one. Let's keep the party rolling. This would be close to 1.5 million. Should be crushing most of their range. Come on now. Ace queen all in. This is huge. Ace nine dominated once again. No. <laughs> ah. That is a huge pot. All right. Flopped dead. I saw the one nine. I was looking for a queen behind. Fuck, there was another nine. It's tough, man. I, I, I do think I want to 3-bet small. I'm going to 3-bet small here. I wish I was deeper. It wouldn't look as nutted. Just going to drive too much fold equity. I think we want to play a non-all in 3-bet size here. But I only started the hand with 23 big blinds. Like, do I do this enough as a bluff? It's tough to say. Hopefully he has the 7s and he feels like he just has to go. Big one, potentially. Tough, 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 tough spot there. High Tiger again raises. This one's pretty close for the minimum. Antis are not full. Probably against the min raise we can defend again. This time we hit a seven. Seven, four, deuce, kind of three cards. They're not really coordinated, but overall like obviously a decent flop for the big blind. They come with the two bigs. I'm gonna call. Five or seven obviously would be Jin, but any other low card like a six, three, uh, eight, all good for my range. Deuce, really hoping to see the check back here. He has a surplus of over pairs that I do not have. But I do have some more trips than him as well. We're really hoping to see the turn check. Yeah, he goes for big size. All right, I, I honestly, I don't know. Maybe he does. I, I don't think humans find enough bluffs here when I check all flop. I have a hand that just doesn't improve. This, I mean, if you run this in a solver, you should never, ever fold this. But humans, when they, he also, his flop size was pretty big. He finds the turn bet. I'm going to make a, an exploitive fold saying, like, I just honestly don't think he's bluffing that much. Especially in a card that's good for me. If he, if he scared me off with the king queen, like, congrats to him. He outplayed me, but... We're going to make an exploitable fold there. Okay, we're going to raise this. Hello. Gives me the defend. Hmm. We're just betting this flop. Mono boards like this. We have top pair, but it's it's not a fun one. We, we do bet quarter here. In position, very small betting very often here. Honestly, if he folds, it's like a huge victory. He has flushes, two pairs. No no sets, though. Sevens and eights would shove pre. Um, okay, calls. That's cool. Options. Bet, and then we get shoved on. We puke, or we could just check back. 
and really pray for a brick and get maybe one straight. Tell you what, I'm going to play a little defensively here. Not what I wanted to see. I do have a lot of big diamonds in my range, though. It's not the card we wanted to see. Eh. I mean, I have so many hands. King, queen, or king, jack with the king of diamonds. I have the nuts here so often. I think turn check was fine, and like, but we just got a really shitty river. Damn it. We have got a day tomorrow, boys and girls. This will be it, you guys. We do get the ladder at 13. If he folds, we're going to shove into four people. He's sitting out. Here we go. GL, GL, Ace-9. We definitely just want to get this through. We don't want action. This is definitely a shove. Intense moments here. Final 13. Just looking to get it through. Just looking to get it through. No snap here is a good sign. Heart rate probably increasing a little bit. Vamos! A great start. A great start. We get that cheeky little ladder, plus we get our original shove through. We go again. We go again. This time, ace jack into five. Probably don't want to get called here, even though we have a pretty decent hand. Looking to get this one through again. Bunch of quick folds. Big call. Okay. Ace Jack. 9-9. Nine, nine. Big flip. Coming my way. Come on. Oh my god. Hold. No diamond. No diamond. Fuck! Ah. GG. Final 13 flip, man. Ouch. We even turned the offsuit ace. Oh boy, another close call, man. Uh, again, happy to be in the spot. We're, we're struggling down the stretch here. We're having a lot of good runs that turn are not turning into, you know, top five, top three finishes. No worries, man. We're going to keep working away. We're having some fun. Hope you are as well. Sub to the YouTube channel. Give us a thumbs up. Come back very soon.